I mean, that's what math is. Math is a tool of making sense of the world around you. So I'm Tim Krieger, I'm a math teacher at Altona Middle School. The setup of the problem is, is the biggest challenge oftentimes, as, as Einstein says. He says oftentimes the, the challenge isn't in solving the problem, it's in setting up the problem. And then after you've got it set up correctly, it's just a trivial calculation, right? I think the bread and butter of any teacher who is doing an awesome job in the classroom is building relationships. Hey, good morning. Good to see you. I mean, that is the most important part of being an educator, like building those relationships, sharing your smile every day, getting to know the students. You know, I'm up at 5.30, 5.45 every morning, sitting at my kitchen table, making coffee, and thinking about how I want um, my students to be talking uh, this day, what I want, what kind of problems I want them to encounter and think through. I'm just really passionate about teaching kids reasoning. I mean, what they need more than anything is reasoning skills. I don't want to just teach them math. Uh, look, numbers are great. I love solving problems. But I want students to feel equipped to use reasoning skills no matter where they find themselves in real life. I hear from a student, you know, years down the road, um, just last week, uh, it was neat, uh, had a student tell me like, oh, you know, I, I'm considering offers from these different universities. Thanks for your part in, you know, helping me, you know, love math or make sense of math. We had another um, a parent who brought uh, a book to school a couple weeks ago. They want me to write a little note in it, you know, statements and notes from their teachers, kindergarten through 12th grade. I think that's so cool. And what I want, want to have students remember about me is that I, I cared about them. Um, I really wanted to encourage them to think and them to, to make sense of the world around them. I mean, that's what math is. Math is a tool of making sense of the world around you. Um, I want them to think back 25 years from now and think, yeah, Mr. Krieger really helped me think about math and see it as a tool and not something to be afraid of, but something that's useful. And he really cared about me. Um, those are the things that I want students to remember. Um, so take a look, here's a, an application where drillers will actually use trigonometry to determine how they can drill and where they can drill. So in meeting the challenge of this year, collaborating with my fellow teachers has been the biggest win. It's not unusual for me to go next door to Ms. Cocker and be like, what technology did you use to get past this or to achieve this goal in your classroom? And same thing, vice versa. There's just been a ton of collaboration, you know, from day one in August. How do we make the environment and the educational classroom fit both those who are online and those who are in person? How can we make them feel like a, a single classroom and move forward together? And I think my educational game has been upped by um, talking with my, my colleagues. So I think that that has been something that has really impressed me with students. They've taken this challenging environment. Oh, next week when we come back from break, we're not going to be in person. We're going to be online again. And they've been able to roll with those punches and, and they've really, I think, risen to the challenge. So I'm impressed with our students.